This is Gary Joyce with the October edition of Dive the Rock. Tsunami Scuba would like to first offer our condolences to the divers and crew that were lost off the coast of California in the Labor Day uh, boat fire. We'd also like to thank the first responders and public safety crews that assisted in the recovery efforts and the investigation efforts that are continuing. Now with that said, I'd like to introduce to you Mr. Mike Berry, who has been on Dive the Rock before and is returning to Okinawa in November to conduct the PADI Public Safety Diving Program and the Underwater Criminal Investigator Certification Program. So Mike, why don't you take it away and tell us a little bit about what you have. Hey everyone, Mike Berry here with uh, UCI and I've been asked to answer a number of questions and the first question that came up was, uh, why would someone want to take public safety diver and underwater criminal investigator? You know, these are uh, public safety courses that uh, teach a lot of things, and it's specifically a course for divers and divers that are offering their services to the public. And there's, uh, there's a number of reasons. The public safety diver is really the, the first step when you get into public safety diving and public safety diving is, is uh, conducted by professional law enforcement, fire, rescue, uh, military, and others, just simply volunteers uh, that know how to dive and they wanna help the public. And so the public safety diver course is that first step and it teaches you, you know, how to respond in a, in a rescue mode. How do, you, how do you interview? How do you triangulate? How do you search? Uh, in, a, in a rescue mode and what that means is you're actually you're actually there trying to save someone's life and so uh, you're learning all these things uh, uh, what can happen along the way and so uh, you're learning how to do self rescues if something goes wrong how to respond to another public safety diver in trouble as well as how how to uh, save someone that's been underwater for uh, less than an hour and so uh, that's the first step and there's there's more training uh, and that uh, foundation that they need is the rescue diver course that teaches you all those rescue diver skills. The uh, underwater criminal investigator course is uh, sort of like that course but it's on steroids. It's more recovery mode. It's teaching you how to respond as a true investigator that specializes in an underwater environment. And so your three cores in underwater criminal investigations is body recovery, vehicle recovery, and evidence recovery. Evidence can be anything. It could be a purse, it could be a safe, it could be a murder weapon, it could be a stolen gun. Well, how do you do that professionally? How do you respond as an extension of the law enforcement agency? So if you have a law enforcement uh, agency and their investigation leads to the water's edge, you know, who do they call? And hopefully they call a professional underwater criminal investigator, someone that can carry on their investigation in the water. You know, with the same standards, the, the same procedures, the same professionalism. And so, and that's what that course is about, is teaching you how to do that. You know, and I, I know that uh, uh, you might be in the military or law enforcement or fire department or with the rescue, uh, you know, uh, you're, a, you're a diver looking at why you should take this training. And uh, the first question is, you know, do you like helping others? Do you like diving? Do you like the challenges that uh, you could be faced with, you know, uh, uh, assisting uh, a professional public safety agency? And if, uh, if that's the case, or you're looking at your future and that's a possibility, these programs are for you. Mike, thank you for the information. We look forward to seeing you in November. And as an aside, um, whenever you may be called or if you are called on as a, as a first responder in a public safety diving situation, you could find yourself in a beach much like this because everything happens and will happen to come to the water's edge. Thank you for joining us. We look forward to seeing you in the next time.